if you have an iPhone from iPhone 6 to iPhone X and it's on passcode or is disabled or isn't connect to iTunes you want to unlock it but if you don't know the iCloud account and the pass and the password I'm going to show you how to do it go into this page fearrain.com and you're going to download the Windows tool or Mac OS whatever you have it's very easy all the instructions are there just click on it it will download and you will extract it all of it you're gonna extract it on local C disk and you're gonna open up a folder name it like this F3 A R R fear and you you will um, pass all everything in there you're gonna decompress it in here once you have it here you click on fear rain start and it's gonna it's going to install all the component all the necessary com components and, and complements all of it is um, it's gonna give you some notices over here some numbers you can call or or uh, send messages text message all the time you will need to buy some credits but I'm gonna show you what to do right now okay it is like I said it is in, in a lock like this it's it's not available because you entered the passcode too many times you need to connect it over here there's two ways one is the processes using um, check ring that means that you you can do uh, jailbreak in this case you can't you can jailbreak it you have to connect it in DFU mode and it will work from iOS 14 15 and 16 right now I I already tried on iOS 14 it didn't work now I'm gonna try it on iOS 15 we have to connect it in in DFU now if you don't know how to put in DFU go to toolbox over here click on it and click here we start connected to now just press on it and it will try to get it in, in recovery mode it's already went dark did not enter recovery mode okay let's do it manually I'm gonna exit this anyway let's go over here press volume up volume down and power keep pressing don't slide to power down just keep on pressing press and hold both buttons wait until the Apple logo disappears if it doesn't work just repeat it let it go and it's recognized by the computer now it's in DFU mode let's close this down go back into processes in DFU connect device see it's working I'm gonna pause it because it goes uh, it takes some time there's some update it's downloading the boot files necessary if it gets stuck just close everything down and put your iPhone again into the FU mode that's already connected let's go into processes in the FU 
and now I'm going to select iOS 16 there's two uh, so I'm going to select the first one here and go to connect device again it's going to work and, and download the boot files that takes a while all the instructions are very understandable it's easy to follow up and it will tell you what to do now it's downloading faster again there's a manual and there's a um, over here it's you just you can write on the using telegram and they're very helpful they're most of the time they're able to help you right away and continue let's go it's gonna ask me to install the driver give it permission there you go install this driver software anyway press ok Here's an update. From here is going to go into a script and to a different face. There's the script. We'll continue going like that. Again, if it stops, don't worry, just close everything down and do it again. Here. The device has been connected now. You can test the compatibility to or activate. So we're going to test com compatibility. It's compatible. Let's press passcode. There's a backup already on their server. Now continue, you need to restore the device to the same version this will take it I'm going to take it out of the FU mode without unplugging it now we're waiting until that gets done and we're going to get it out of the FU mode and restore it okay now it's asking us to put it in dfu mode way to do it is press volume up volume up and power wait until it disappears let it let it go it's going to turn on into regular mode and then we need to put it in DFU mode. It's already restored. It's going to exit recovery. Let's wait for it. Done. Once it has restored, just uh, connect it again in DFU mode. Wait until it goes in. Once it has restored and you connect it in DFU mode again, it's going to let you know that the device has been connected. You can now test comp compatibility or connect. It should appear. Let's press test comp compatibility. let's press passcode to activate it it's going to open up um, a page for payment you need to pay for it we're going to see the price for this here are the different prices since we are on ios 
16 and it's a, uh, an iPhone 6 I mean an iPhone X this is uh, okay DFU passcode is over here the cost for our device is $25 and so we need to buy at least $25 in credit over here Let's press over there or write it here now I'm going to pay for it okay now as you can see um, I have 24 27 dollars and 50 cents and now I press oh then so you can see it over here you press passcode I have enough credit do you want to pay it yes I do some people want everything free and now not everything can be for free these guys they work very hard and uh, I need I think they deserve it plus you're gonna get a fully working iPhone X uh, to make calls text messages I I message FaceTime all everything you only you cannot restore it or update it There you go. Activate it. So let's go. Gonna continue. Gonna put my D my Wi-Fi. And there you go. Face ID, set up later. Passcode options, don't use it right now. You can create it, but I don't need it right now. Don't transfer. Later. Don't use. Agree. Continue. Not now. Enable. Set up later. Don't share. Dark. Go to the side. Always go to the dark side. Continue. And welcome to your iPhone. There you go. It's activated. If you rain. 20 25 dollars to get it up and running and you can do it yourself very easy just follow all the instructions uh call their tele telegram number or get into discord uh, they, there's ronnie there help you it, he can help you almost 24 7. thank you